Uh, yes, that's true. Globalisation has opened up opportunities for companies that previously didn't exist. You know, a generation or so ago, uh, you marketed in your town. If you were really adventurous, you marketed in your county. Um, you could have marketed nationally, but you know that was for the big boys only. The thought of being ex of exporting your services abroad was almost alien. But that was, you know, 30, 40, 50 years ago. Nowadays, um, with the click of a mouse, you can be, as it were, in China or, or in India or in Russia. The key, though, to, to globalisation is to understand the local culture over there. I mean, it's, it's bad enough if you're trying to sell to strangers uh, in the next street, but imagine trying to sell to strangers in a foreign country with foreign culture and a foreign language. So if you do intend uh, to sell your services overseas, my first port of call would be to talk to the export specialists at your local Chamber of Commerce. If you're not a member of the Chamber of Commerce, it's worth signing up for that alone. They know all the routes into, they've got already the contacts, uh, probably wherever you want to be. They can introduce you to people, they can give you letters of passage. So they can do all that groundwork for you. But remember, just because there are umpty million Russians who don't buy your sproggets doesn't mean that there are umpty million Russians who will buy your sproggets.